it's just a bigger ring, I guess, and that's probably the big thing about it. And I mean, it's uh, it's first sport in Slovakia, so like everybody's cheering when when there's a hockey game. It's uh, same as here, so like I really enjoy it, I and mean, that's a good thing. I mean, it's uh, it's a dream for probably like uh, every European player, and I I didn't even like uh, think about like USHL or something. I wanted to try Canada, and they drafted me two years ago, so I was kind of surprised that they drafted me that year, not like a uh, uh, year after. So I went, and I'm here. I mean, it was. It was kind of hard, you know, because that was my that was my first time away from family. But I mean, uh, at first I was in the Lethbridge Hurricanes, so that's Alberta, and people were real helpful. Like uh, GM there, he was he was like asking me if I need something like every day. So I mean, that helped me a lot. I mean, probably the biggest one is. Uh, when we played in uh, Calgary, because Calgary and Edmonton are playing like uh, at the NHL rinks, and there was a uh, teddy bear toss in Calgary, and there was uh, 18,000 people, and yeah, I mean, they scored a goal, but at first they hit the post, and people thought it was a goal, so they started throwing like uh, teddy bears on the ice, so we didn't play for like uh, 20 minutes, then we started again because like it wasn't a goal so like they scored in like five minutes so they started throwing that again and we didn't play for 40 minutes because like it was it was so like uh pretty cool and i know i didn't want to like to be scored on but like it was pretty cool <laughs> I was I was pretty stressed out to be honest for the first time in a national team and I've played a lot of games in the national team cuz like uh if you're a better player in Slovakia it's not that hard to be like in a national team but I mean it helped me a lot it, like uh I wasn't stressed at the like world juniors and stuff so yeah that's what I would say probably Yeah, I mean, when we played in Edmonton, there was like uh, 5,000 people, and it seems it, it seemed like uh, it was 500. But like uh, in Seattle, I mean, it was it was actually packed when there were like those 18,000 there, and it was unreal. Like atmosphere was so cool. But I mean, um, the bigger atmosphere was uh, when we were at the Halifax, I guess, when we played against Canada, I and mean, I couldn't hear my own word. It was it was. It was cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm always proud to like represent my country, and you gotta do like best work at the at that stage because there's a uh, there's a lot of scouts and stuff like that, and that's like uh, that's like your one lifetime opportunity, I would say. Yeah, I mean. We will have like uh we'll have uh again like sixteen guys uh we, we can play again next year. So I mean next year will be will be tough for Canada and other teams. But I mean when I came back uh it was uh it was a little bit slower, you know, because like uh I was playing against like the best guys in Canada and I was I really enjoyed it, you know. I didn't even I didn't be like uh stressed or was stress or something because like it was it was so cool I mean it kind of bumped me to be honest because I played against them uh, in the WHL before so like I kind of knew them and I know they're amazing players but at the end of the day I had to show like uh, how how good player I am to other like scouts and to them, I was I was like chirping uh, Altman players like that, and they then they told me they have they have like signed NHL contracts. So I was I was kind of quiet after that. <laughs> that 
Probably Connor Bedard, I would say. Like, he's kind of cocky, to be honest. But like, I would be cocky probably too if I would be a player like that. But like, I think he's probably the the best one. And yeah, definitely. <laughs> I mean, it was a big game for all the guys. Like our coach said, that's a that's a first NHL game for us because like f like uh, all guys from Canada will probably play NHL, and we we like uh, we play against them. So that was a big game, and we were we were thinking about win for a whole game, and we've seen like when we were like three three, and we went to overtime. It was it was amazing and we tried to do the best thing. We had a lot of like scoring chances in the overtime. But like then one guy showed up and <laughs> he scored. So like uh yeah. That's a history and I mean we played a good tournament and they probably deserve it. I mean, I enjoyed it. I'm not that type uh who's like uh, stressed out. I was stressed out when I was like younger, but I mean I have I have a lot of games now in my in my history so I mean I really just enjoyed it and it was it was unreal to play there cuz they were cheering and overtime you know and stuff and I know it was just a it was just a great experience Yeah definitely when they scored like it was like from sci-fi it was it was it was so weird like I can't put it to words like it was it was just so weird. I mean, I I I love this like coaching staff cuz like they're I don't want to say it like that, but they're like uh like friendly and they're like friends and I really like that. You know, I don't like when coaches like uh like swearing at you and stuff like all the time that you're doing like a bad thing and I like when they tell me like what I'm doing wrong and stuff like that and I, I think that's uh that's the biggest thing of my like uh of my uh of my like playing here so Jim Guy and Kevin have a soft side then yes yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean fans are amazing yeah. because like uh it's way better than in the uh, Cape to be honest because once we had like 200 fans at the Sunday game and that was pretty disappointing, but I mean, this crowd is unreal, and even even with, if uh, we are uh, lower in the standings, they're still cheering, and I really like that. Yeah, I mean, we're a good good group, and I mean, we'll make it because like uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of good future in the room, and I mean, I don't know about last year, but I probably wouldn't want to be a rookie last year because there was a lot of like uh, big names. And when we played against Charlottetown last year, it was a uh, it was always tough to play against Charlottetown last year. So yeah. I mean, I was always playing like with uh, with good guys, and I mean, the biggest influence was probably like. Uh, Slavkovsky and Mashar because they're like uh, and Simon Nemec because they're like uh, really like my best buddies and we played together since like uh, I was playing with Slavkovsky in like six and with the uh, other guys since like uh, 14 and against them since like 10 so like uh, we were really good buddies and always when uh, Slavkovsky was giving me like uh, advice or something because he was always uh at the different level, you know, and he was talking to scouts when he was <laughs> freaking like 12. So he was like, uh, he was saying, he was uh, giving me like advices about like hockey, what should I do, what should I not do. And that's, that's, that's probably the biggest thing why, why I'm actually like here because like he gave me a lot. Yeah, actually, I was in uh, when we played in uh, Blainville. I was watching uh, the Montreal game, but like he was injured, so we went uh, to 
got food after, and yeah, he drove me back. So yeah, yeah. I played on a guitar. I was doing acting, and I was playing like a floorball. I don't know if you know what that is. It's like a with the uh, with the uh, holes in a stick, and like uh, yeah, and that's that's a, like a pretty big sport in Europe. So like yeah. I was watching Goodwill Hunting the other day, and I mean, it really hit me. It was pretty. It's it's a pretty cool movie, and yeah, that's probably that movie. I have to think about that one, but I mean, maybe Kieran, because <laughs> he's a redhead, so like. Uh, I uh, know. I would probably pick him. <laughs> uh, definitely Hendo. I was I was actually thinking about that one. Definitely Simon Hughes. Simon Hughes. Yeah. No. <laughs> never. I just really want to thank you for uh, for for me to uh, like enjoy it here and uh, I know I I really enjoy it here and uh, be sportive and like we'll make playoffs and it'll be good no worries. <laughs>